SBM Offshore's next generation semi-submersible has been designed in close collaboration with major operators, partners, and key vendors. Through innovative design, early industry engagement, and efficient execution planning, SBM is pleased to offer the market a safe, reliable, and cost-effective solution for a wide range of field development scenarios. Our simplified hull offers a number of key benefits, such as standardization of key components and reduced internal equipment. Built in sections, the hull is easily scalable to meet topside processing requirements from 60 to 120,000 barrels of oil per day without significant redesign. SBM's two-layer truss deck enables increased safety and efficiency whilst reducing construction time. Main utilities are located on the lower deck, allowing for topside modules to be installed and pre-commissioned as they are delivered. The top deck is designed to act as a blast barrier from the topside processing system. SBM has leveraged its rich history of FPSO topside modular design and transferred this to the semi-submersible sector with focus on overall weight reduction. Modular design allows for simultaneous fabrication in either the same yard or multiple, Asia or the Gulf of Mexico. Once all modules are installed on the truss deck in pre-commissioned, the entire top side is integrated onto the hull and towed to site. In water depths ranging from 4,000 to 8,000 feet, the semi-submersible is a perfect solution to provide safe and reliable production for a wide range of field developments, including high pressure and high temperature reservoirs. The favorable floater motion of a semi-submersible allows for the use of steel cantonary risers, or SCRs, which eliminate the need for expensive alternative riser systems. SBM Offshore has the capability and experience to perform coupled riser and global performance analysis. As a base case, SBM has selected the inline mooring connector system, offering a reduction in total lifetime cost of facility ownership when evaluating both CapEx and OpEx. Already installed on SBM's designed and delivered Turatella FPSO in the Gulf of Mexico, the ILMC allows for tensioning of the mooring line subsea, thus removing the need for traditional chain handling equipment in the hull, such as winches, jacks, and chain lockers. Significant weight reduction, simplification, and safety improvement have been achieved as a result of our innovative hull design based upon SBM's proven deep draft semi-hull. Primarily accessed for inspections and non-routine maintenance only, access tunnels in the pontoons have been removed and proven submersible pumps introduced in lieu of pumps in the column. Submersible pumps can be maintained from the top of column without the need for entry into the hull. Incorporating the ILMC system leads to a total estimated weight savings of over 1,700 tons, plus easier fabrication and commissioning. In addition, this enables increased payload capacity for the top sides if required. The utility deck is divided into hazardous and non-hazardous zones, with a plated deck above separating the top sides, allowing safe egress during an emergency. It incorporates standard connections to ensure ease of interface and commissioning with the topside modules. Such features significantly reduce risk, schedule, and cost. Designed with efficiency, capex, and opex in mind, the modular process system offers significant benefits over traditional stick-built, customized topsides. The majority of modules are standardized, with only the inlet, main gas, and export modules customized to each specific reservoir. The inlet module is designed to bring any reservoir pressure and temperature to normalized levels, allowing for standardized oil separation, water treatment, flash gas compression, and gas dehydration modules thereafter. Standard module dimensions and interfaces allow for the swap out of modules, depending on reservoir properties or topside production capacity. The modules consist of three decks, the production, mezzanine, and PSV decks. Despite the modular design, all decks are interconnected and accessible by stairs, allowing for multiple egress routes in case of emergency and ease of access for regulatory testing.
Installation of universal I.O. panels on each module, as opposed to conventional ICSS junction boxes, gives the module fabricators the benefit of terminating all wiring at the panel itself, therefore reducing pre-commissioning time, risk, and cost. This is just one of a number of efficiency-enhancing digital features incorporated into the new semi-submersible design. The laydown area for loading and offloading of materials and supplies is located adjacent to the accommodation module, allowing for quick and efficient transfer of provisions to the galley. The accommodation comprises of three floors and is designed for 50 POB. Rated for large work-class Sikorsky S92 helicopters, the helideck also has the optional parking space for a second helicopter, giving the semi-submersible flexibility in busy periods or times of emergency. SBM's Next Generation Semi has been designed in collaboration with a wide range of operators, key vendors, and regulators. Through trust and alignment, we have focused on balancing CapEx and OpEx to ensure the right solution is available for a wide range of field scenarios. Our feed complete design will enable operators to expedite their concept, FID, and EPC schedules, ultimately leading to faster first oil or gas. The next generation semi is a fully flexible solution with a wide range of options depending upon client and field specifics.